And some uh, breaking news on top of the live report. The Mumbai police has begun an investigation into the alleged incident of moral policing couples. The hotel owner and the police involved, policemen involved in this case will be asked to record their statement. In fact, uh, the Mumbai police has requested the couples to come forward with the complaints. In fact, it's a big, big development because uh, it's the first time the police have accepted that uh, they have done something wrong. Let's go across to Sindhu joining us on the phone line. Sindhu, we're given to understand that uh, they have asked these couples to come forward and record their complaints against the police has been set up by the Commissioner of Police Rakesh Maria under the Regional Additional Commissioner of Police, Mr. Fateh Singh Patil. Now, Mr. Patil will be inquiring into the incident which had happened last week on Thursday. He will be summoning all the couples involved. He will also be investigating with the police officers in the teams who were there while raiding the said hotels. And he will also be speaking to the hotel owners about the incident. Now, the problem here will be calling the couple, summoning them, because most of them, all of them actually were in a relationship. None of them were married. These were couples who were dating. So they will have to figure out how to summon them, how to call them, whether they will be sending them a letter or they will they, be calling them. And if perhaps some a couple refuses to come, then the police will again have to figure out how to do their, carry forward their investigation. They raided a hotel room which was deemed private. They can't claim public indecency in private space and uh, the police uh, seem to have forgotten that. The police have begun their investigation. However, hopefully there will be action taken in the case uh, developments uh, in the case this evening. Quick, let's listen in to what the hotel owner said earlier on the incident. Police have our hotel तो हमारे यहाँ गेस्ट थे कि 17 रूम्स हमारे पास गेस्ट थे तो इन्होंने आके रेड करके चेकिंग का बाहर करने के लिए बोल आया था चेकिंग तो लोग हमेशा करते हैं रोज आके चेक कर देंगे अपना रजिस्टर चेक करते हैं साइन करके निकल जाते हैं लेकिन परसों जो रेड किया उन्होंने वो सब गेस्ट को मेरा नीचे उतर के सबका आईडी चेक करके इनको पुलिस स्टेशन में लेके जाके एक-एक को 1200 Last week on Thursday, 40 couples were rounded up by the Malwani police and charged for indecent behavior in public. These couples were staying in privately owned hotel rooms in Mad Marve Island. However, they were still charged by the police. They were rounded up and made to stay at the Malwani police station for five hours and humiliated by various cops. They were made to call their parents and tell them about their incident. The incident has invited a lot of outrage from the civil society which has accused the Mumbai police of indulging in moral policing in Mumbai with video journalist Rajesh Khade, Sindhu Mansukhani reporting for Times Now. Well, that was a, a report sent from the location. Let's go back to Sindhu. She's on the phone line with us, tracking the latest developments from the investigation perspective. Uh, Sindhu, we're given to understand that there is no deadline that's set for the committee, which is now probing this moral policing by their own. Exactly. There is no deadline. Mr. Patil has said, who is inquiring into the incident, that unless something big comes up in his north region, his uh, whole uh, attention will be into this inquiry. But no, the CP has not given him a deadline. The only focus is to give some results in the investigations as soon as possible. Yeah, stay with us, uh, Sindhu. Also getting in some inputs from uh, Ashish joining us on the phone line. Uh, Ashish, clear violation for the police because, uh, you know, there have been several complaints of constables slapping some of these uh, women who are detained, S co the cops forcing them to pay up for no fault of theirs, being detained for at least five hours at a stretch, publicly humiliated by these police, forced to call parents and insulted. So essentially what the police were doing here is cashing in on the stigma. That's right. And this is not the first time when uh, the Mumbai police has come down to this level. If you remember, uh, uh, Dr. Satipal Singh was a former Mumbai uh, police commissioner and is currently the BJP uh, MP. Uh, he had also dictated some similar uh, diktat. Uh, in fact, had also issued an order at that point of time. So uh, now the precedent was uh, set at that point of time, and that is the reason the uh, junior staff uh, below the rank of uh, uh, the uh, inspectors, they uh, tend to do these things. But now 
The Mumbai Police Commissioner Rakesh Maria has really pulled up the uh, senior officials and uh, uh, the sensitization is something what is required here at the lowest level, uh, uh, including the constables and inspectors level in the Mumbai Police because Mumbai is a city known for uh, uh, maximum life and the nightlife as well. And if these things continue to happen in a city like Mumbai, then certainly it will have a lot of uh, uh, repercussion. But interestingly, the political side has not uh, uh, come up. We are expecting the young leaders like like uh, Milin Devra, Shana and seen others to uh, come up and uh, raise this issue. But uh, that is something we need to wait for some more time to see whether the uh, young political class, at least from uh, Mumbai and Maharashtra, uh, they come forward to deal with such situation or not. Back to you. Right. Ashish, do stay with us because we're getting in more reactions. Times now reporting the story. Also asking a few straight questions to the Mumbai police for acting against consulting adults. It was an illegal raid at the end of the day. More reactions coming in from the site, from the hotel where the raids were held last weekend. What happened to me? I was not there. I was in the small one. You were in the small one? What happened to you? No. I didn't know anything. Who did you know? Okay, now who is in the hotel? Who is in the owner? Who is in the owner? Yes, but what will you take in the owner? Who is 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 in the owner? We are meeting the additional commissioner and also trying to arrange a meeting with the DCP concerned to actually understand and know from him what is what are their expectations because you know uh, as far as the hoteliers are concerned as as far as we are concerned we have been following the rules you know they have asked us to do a CCTV in our entire property we have done that they they want us to do a proper registration in their in their registration that also we do we we need to take proper identification that also we do we are trying to know from the authorities what else we need to do extra to make our patrons and our 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 guests safe because this is something that is unacceptable to us